Good morning, Pirates. Today is Monday, December 16th, and welcome to our AM show. Today we have a highlight of SJA's Indigenous Peoples Day. The Social Justice Academy held an information table for Indigenous Peoples Day, informing students about the colonization, not discovery, of America, and the many important Native American figures in our history that is often left out in history texts. There was information, great artwork, and the quad smelled wonderful with sage smudging. Hey Pirates, have you purchased your yearbook yet? Here's a video about that. Hey seniors, this is a friendly reminder that yearbook quotes are due on December 19th. Check out the link in their school emails for the rules, and be sure to follow them precisely or your quote will not be published. Feel free to email Mr. Nichols at tnichols at slusd.us if you have any questions. To all Pirates who would like to purchase a yearbook, it is currently $69.99 at yearbookforever.com. They will soon go up to $74.99 after the break. Here's a sneak peek at this year's yearbook cover. Thank you for listening to this PSA. Next, we have the creator of our next film, Kennedy. Hi guys. This is just a short bit about a really cool presentation in Mr. Gordon's class. On Wednesday and Thursday, December 4th and 5th, Mr. Gordon's environmental science classes hosted guest speaker, Dr. Hoi Fei Monk, who led the students in the Game of Extremes Climate Adaptation Planning Scenario. The Game of Extremes teaches players how to think like an urban planner to help understand the complexities of making our cities more resilient to the climate crisis. Dr. Mock is a San Leandro High School class graduate of 2006 and is currently working as the City of San Leandro Sustainability Manager. That was really cool. Thanks, Kennedy. Now we have a message from UNICEF. On Sunday, December 15th, UNICEF had a volunteering event at the Community Impact Lab inside of Bayfair Mall, which consists of making care packages and sorting toys for kids. Come to the UNICEF meetings on Tuesdays in room 242 for more community service opportunities. Thanks, UNICEF, for making such a big impact in our community. Next, we have restaurant reviews of Mel's. On Wednesday, December 11th, me and my friends went to Mel's Diner, located at 15011 Hesperian Boulevard. Mel's is a 90s theme restaurant. There is a jukebox at your table, which you can play songs on for a dollar. While we were there, we ordered a chocolate shake and a sample dish that came with fries, chicken strips, wings, and mozzarella sticks. The food was really cheap, especially for how much we got. Overall, it was a really great experience, and it had a really nice atmosphere and great servers. Bye, Pirates! Mmm, that looks good. Now we have a video about what to do on a rainy day.
do it tomorrow. Finally, let's see how well our SLHS scholars know about their states. Hi, I'm Sydney. Hi, I'm Tori. And today we're going to be asking parents if they know their state. Let's go. All right, what state is this? Alaska. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> what state is this? Uh, Mississippi? Yeah, there it is, Mississippi. What state is this? I don't know. Alabama? What state is this? Texas. Yes. What state is this? Uh, Florida? What state is this? Tennessee. <laughs> oh, Oklahoma. No. Uh, <laughs> it's, no, it's not Florida. Florida's long. Um, Michigan. What state is this? Hawaii? No. <laughs> RJ, what state is this? Kansas? Wait, wait, wait. Connecticut? <laughs> Sierra, what state is this? Um, <laughs> what's it, Tennessee? I don't know. <laughs> Good job! What state is this? Where are you going? <laughs> right. That's <laughs> New Hampshire. <laughs> New Jersey. And that's our show. Enjoy your break. Happy New Year, Pirates. Arg!